Mishlei, Proverbs chapter 19. Better is the poor walking in his integrity than one of perverse lips who is a fool. Also, desire without knowledge is not good, and he who hurries with his feet sins. The foolishness of a man perverts his way, and his heart is wroth against Yah. Wealth adds many friends, but the poor is separated from his friend. A false witness does not go unpunished, and he who breathes out lies does not escape. Many entreat the favor of the noble, and all are friends to him who gives gifts. All the brothers of the poor shall hate him. How much more shall his friends go far from him? He pursues promises. They are gone. He who gets heart loves his own He who gets heart loves his own life. He who guards understanding finds good. A false witness does not go unpunished, and he who breathes out lies perishes. Luxury is not fitting for a fool, much less for a servant to rule over princes. A man's discretion makes him patient, and his adorning is to pass over a transgression. The sovereign's wrath is like the roaring of a lion, but his delight is like dew on the grass. A foolish son is a calamity to his father, and the contentions of a wife are a continual dripping. Houses and riches are the inheritance from fathers, but an understanding wife is from Yah. Laziness makes one fall into a deep sleep, and an idle being suffers hunger. He who guards the command guards his life. He who despises his ways dies. He who shows favor to the poor lends to Yah and he repays his deed. Discipline your son because there is expectation, and do not set your being on his destruction. One of great wrath bears punishment. For if you rescue him, you only have to do it again. Listen to counsel and accept discipline, so that you are wise in your latter end. Many are the plans in a man's heart, but it is the counsel of Yah that stands. What is desirable in a man is his loving commitment, and a poor man is better than a liar. The fear of Yah leads to life, and he remains satisfied. He is not visited by evil. A lazy one buries his hand in a dish and does not bring it back to his mouth. Strike a scoffer, and the simple is made wise, and reprove one who has understanding and he discerns knowledge. He who plunges a father chases away his mother, is a son causing shame and bringing reproach. Cease, my son, to hear discipline, and you shall stray from the words of knowledge. A witness of Belial scorns right ruling, and the mouth of the wrong ones devours wickedness. Judgments are in store for scoffers, and beatings for the backs of fools.